Ye is gonna push elbow. Got the sheriff. Oh no, he's been completely caught out by Patty there. The slow push up elbow. Yeah, yeah that's what he is. We've got every take that's gonna have to be set up here, but F Finesse actually not able to win the battle there, and that's unfortunate because they again they're, they're looking for the retake, but now they've got no players left to actually set up a coordinated retake. It's a two versus five. five. We think Marv and Crashies are gonna hit, have to hit some incredible shots. Marv starts things off nicely, Crashies as well. And suddenly, a one versus two. Fox, Foxy very low. And Patty's gonna swing up. The timing oh. is very much with Patty on that one. And next 10, they're gonna break wall. And Foxy with the recon to get into the B side, the drone to make sure no one's pushing up, post plant. I am so impressed by the spacing and timing on these X10 pushes. And this is the first thing you have to deal with is the Hall's players, and that's going to slow things down somewhat. Envy now starting to encroach the upon the B site, but these post plant positions are certainly going to be strong here. Stinger comes out, huge there for Finesse, able to swap out and create that presence on the flank. That's going to enable the remainder of Envy to start pushing from spawn, but Sushi Boy with a nice defense there, keeping this alive so far for X10, and more than that, in fact, it's going to just close it out. Information by time for the rotation. Looking for the first peak, he's going to find it. What a great bit of game sense coming out to suppress a bunch of players. Get info as to how many are actually there, and Spike will go down. X10 trying to now defend the Spike, and Ye is just doing more damage here. Victor up close, can't break that forward line here. Crashy so excited to work on it and we're gonna get this reinforced fight at the back of the wall by the right side pyramid and Sushi Boy's trying to hold on to this one by himself. He's been good with the Bulldog so far, but so many players not happening this time around. Well, there's only 15 seconds to get the spike planted. Finesse could do so much damage here. How many can Finesse get? That's two. Again, time is a huge oh. problem. Finesse and Crashies will finish it all off. And Foxy's left with nothing to do. No time, no spike, no teammates. Oscillation or maybe. No more. Big frag for a lot of ults up in this round, actually. And there's that balls push, but yay, ready to get put up. Welcome to my world. Oh, we get a counter Viper's Pit to allow the X10 players to push through, but everyone else is just happy to spray forward. Yay, the same. Scary able to get back sight, but again, not too many teammates left. Ooh, taking some damage standing. there from the snake bite and he's alone. There's the first one there from Scary. I just pit catches another headshot. Very good effort, but too little too late there. So we'll see if he can get something again at the beginning. Again, just always at the right place at the right time is Ye at the beginning of these rounds. And he's just putting another one. They're gonna just collapse on that. A nice two for one. Foxy now aggressing up onto Ye, and Ye looks real aware of this, Dan. He very much does. Foxy though, is going to be very key, Patty picks up one, Hunter's Fury, Foxy looking for the perfect moment, they haven't spotted him, Foxy gets two, he knows, one more is around the corner, Crashies, Crashies will come back and just catch Foxy, falling back, one more to go, and Crashies is good for it, oh that was oh, very got, close, he's the boy, get him up Dan, get, get him, him up, up. obviously gets suppressed, but he posts a KO, but he's still going for it, Victor, extremely confident, well, he go for some more here, backing away, he's got teammates here, it's good spacing. That game is taken away from you. And they're going for the plan B, quite literally. Ooh. Oh! I know exactly where Both of those frags work out for them, Dan. The site's open, the Neural Theft comes in, it's free, the plant's going down. Oh Fight my planted. goodness, look at this Viper lurking mid too. Is FNS going to be aware of this? It's pretty forcing, oh my gosh. Oh, well now he spotted it. But does he allow Scary to slow him down? Yeah, maybe. Scary's really out of position here. And oh my <laughs> god, Scary is going to completely destroy Finesse. But on the side, we'll see Victor and Ye making their way forward. Victor very low at this point. Ye on that operator. And Ye does have the dash and the cloud burst still. And updraft. He's got a full kit to wear. We're swapping out for the rifle. A little bit more dynamic. Oh. Nice. Takes his time. Where's the last player? By Sushi Boys. I think he heard the step. Ye. He's going to save the day there for Envy and keep them on that streak. Six rounds in a row here for Envy. As far as North American teams go uh, between Sentinels and Envy. But we'll come back to that in a moment as we have Ooh. rounds now opening up quite nicely for Cruz and Patty. X10 taking that mid control. Talking up the individual plays there of Envy. We get X10 striking quite effectively. Trying to just now uh, get that movement going towards that B site. The split works out. Uh, oh, what? No. <laughs> Patsy was so unaware of that as well. That's somewhat outrageous. And a marvelous streak. 
very aggressive play into mid. I don't even know if there was much utility used. I just know crew through the Oh my god, this could just destroy the entire round. Will they ever check for this? Oh, he's just gonna pull the trigger straight away. And he is just dug into this position. Into the cloud first actually goes outside, very far, very far outside of the site. Very far off. He's very fair of the flank. Time to push the ball is now the sushi boy. Gets himself the one kill onto Crashies. The toxic screen comes Ooh. up to allow Sushi Boys to get out of there. That's a neural fat too. So now they know precise. Time is against him, Foxy. Oh, oh my god, Mark. Last round, and they might be able to put six on, on the board. Yes, yeah, it's looking tough. Flashback. Aggressive push coming from X10. Up mid from Elbow. Trying to split back into that B side oh. once again. Three kills, quick succession for X10. Finesse wrapping around the corner. Beautiful stuff there to try to equalize. Two versus. Viper's pit is there too. They're not planting though, and FNS is holding them in. They're gonna have to go right into him. Oh, they're not looking the right way up. There they go. Find the frag, the trade on to FNS. Uh, snake bikes remaining as well for Scary, so. And he win the gunfights. They're looking to double peek this one perhaps. As long as they don't allow 1v1s, so they'll be fine. And there we go. Scary finishes it off. Hey, board, yeah, he coming. That Sheriff oh. and it's lame, but it manages to make it happen. Still stays alive for another! Yay! Oh. Opens it up beautifully right there. And now Envy are in good stead. Crashy's holding down K, but maybe not. Victor on the other end of it, though. Looking to try to recover here. Oh, such a heads-up uh, maneuver there to just go for the player coming back. And now Victor remaining. once again playing it. Door up. Well, that's a huge sound cue. Name precisely where Scary is in this elevated position. Three players all across this A site. Put a deal with one, but they're not giving him the rest. It's not going to be easy here for Scary, and he's going to go down. So the vision is obscured by the toxic screen, the poison orb, and Andy looking to explode straight through this one. Yay! Just dashes through seven HP off to just take him, just tanking the damage and the toxic screen. Viper walls all over the place right now. Oh my god! Oh god! This is like a math exercise, <laughs> like the Pythagoras theorem. Four versus four now, as the site is taken under control here for Envy. Looking for that plant, there it goes. Foxy jumping down, and the Vipers War is going to certainly obscure things here. Allow these Envy players to fall back into post-plant positioning, but not without losing finesse along the way. And here comes Sushi Boy, but it's not too much left. The plant will certainly go down. Oh. And this is, I mean, it's one frag on the way back there against Vanessa again. But there's no ults here, really, except, I mean, through his ult, KO ult hits, trying to work their way back in, and others again, Envy. Aggressive poking there, not allowing X10 to coordinate their retake. Just poking and prodding, and here goes again. Oh. Yay, meet Scary and spawn. And all these sound cues now, ready to just exploit. Oh, <laughs> a little bit awkward, but I mean, Mars gonna get done with sign something. And there it is, he there does find is. the opening onto Marked Patty. through. Oh, this is so complex to like deal with this. And we have so many opportunities now because of their early round setup. And Marv there, up on heaven, scanning into the site. He's surely going to catch somebody at some point. Foxy though, catching left. Victor. Nine seconds, Dan. And that's a spike down. And oh no, Foxy, he's just found that one linchpin of this round. And he is locking down that spike. There's no time. And Scary can just win. He gets the Red Bull clutch for doing nothing. That's in the hole. This is going to come down to Padovan on this operator, but Ye wins the battle again. Defensive on the Fury just to slow things down here, but there's that. Look, unlocked by Martin. This is a much better look for it. Bob is just dropping everybody, but Foxy with that return, can he win that next key fight? He can! Oh, this is dangerous and there's nothing left for Ye. Finesse lurking up mid. Might be able to catch Foxy here. Or Ye, I'm sorry, that was Ye. Ye catches. So, I feel as though it's all on Patty's shoulders. Has Ooh. the support. The sushi boy. There's that first shot. I think gets a leg shot with that one. Marv takes down his assistance. Uh, but however, Cruz down, makes his way beat. forward. Takes down Ye. Another frag for him in mid. Beautiful stuff from Cruz. Patty holding it down as best he can with a shorty backside. But two versus two. FNS pause for a second there to put an alarm bot on the flank. And that's really, really big. Spike planted. Last player standing. Able to take that one down, but Cruz. Now left his own devices by himself. And Crashy. It looked like X10 had all of the right plays there. Especially Padavan. I thought he did such a good job holding down the B site. 
he did he really kept on aggressing despite getting suppressed. You know, right into the A point, but big movement on the flank from X10 all the way down mid. Three players down mid. Scary goes down. And that's unfortunate. Those those retake walls are very important. And the pit comes out. Dan from Marved and the double flank is spotted by FNS. Oh my, gets two. Padafan trades it out. But we're still in a three-on-one with only Padafan up. It's over, Dan. They're on this mid-market area. Okay. Gonna get a quick shot coming out of Foxy to take down Ye. And with that, now Finesse is gonna be left alone by Pizza to hold it down, but he can't. It's a five versus three retake in favor of X10 as they start to amble forwards into that site, that B site, and they're winning every battle right now. Victor and Mob is all the stance here now. Just Mob gets four players to dash. Oh, it's just impossible. X10. I mean, it looked like at the beginning of the rounds they had uh, they missed the mark, but oh, again the A main aggression. Look at this, the D recon again, the zero point. They're pushing all the way through. Spike is down. Oh, oh, oh. They want gelato. They want that sweet, sweet gelato control, and so far so good. The spike there. <laughs> That's amazing from Envy. Yeah, and Marv has a spare nebula down at the door. FNS lurk up, Cat. This will be a tough, tough drag for Patrick to find. Nest. Uh, the timing is just perfect there. Oh. Great round from Envy, converting off of the like Cat. It's a Seeker zone, he's the protection, Patty with the wide swing there to protect him, and he gets a second out of it. Good stuff from Patty. Four versus three advantage now. Make that actually a four versus two. With Ye going down for X10. One enemy remaining. Oh, oh. Cruz destroys FNS in A right there, leaving crashes in this one on four. 30 seconds with a left. lot to do. <laughs> it's just, yeah. Yeah, just... Trailblazer goes through. Okay, Patty was spotted. That's the operator. Oh, what a catch wow. from Ye taking down Patty. Maybe the most dangerous player there for X10. Sushi Boys has a lot to do on the site. It's Foxy trying to get those tags there with the recon dot. But he's getting the across and oh, yeah, he's just undeniable there on the site. Ooh, as he finds one through the smoke, Victor goes down. But still a four on two down. This is a very difficult round to win. That will help. Yeah, Foxy's been so great. Two versus three. Still tough. Foxy though. Able to get one capitalize off the distraction from Cruz, but Cruz is in trouble here. Multiple peaks, Cruz! Oh, there was a real opportunity there. Yeah, he might catch scary and he's Oh, that's it, surely. There he goes. It's a free one. A trailblazer sent Whoa. out. And another frag from Patty. He is revving up at the moment now. To, to probably synergize a couple of these alts. In the past, when I've seen Marv use about this one to clear out that three position. And that's gonna take down Sushi Boys. Two players. Oh, but they're going up, heaven, Dan. They're going up. And, and yeah, Patty's able to defend against the door position. Gets a second as Five well, using eight. Scary to trade off of and still holding on to a key position. And the spike. The spike's up there. Now there's a minute to go to try to recover this one. And two players for Envy to do it. Here. Can they find a way? You want to it? Oh, Cosmic Divide comes through. That isolates Patty. Oh. How good is Patty? Oh. Not good enough for that one. That's beautiful from Marv and Crashies. Now makes it into a two versus one here in favor of Envy. Timing from Foxy. Oh, he had the pre. Just, he lined it up as well. You love his Envy. Oh, oh, Patty. I can't believe you've done that. Not to EA. And the that's just to get away oh, in presence. Do they go back to a B split here? Leaving the turret right there in, in the tree position. But Cruz taking out Marv on the lurk. They were really hoping Marv can get that, and that, that really filters them into a bad position here left. into this A site. Yeah, this is like plan C at this point. They were, they yeah. were wanting to split B, and, but now they have to go. They, they're committed towards the same position. Safety boy. Neural Theft comes down, and that's going to give him the info. And just, he's just continuation spraying all the way forward. He knows that they have to push, and they've got no other opportunity. Sushi Boy will go down, but he's done more than his fair chef. And that's why they've dashed, or they're, they're pushing, they're pushing Gelato here. They're going to find Marv. Marv takes down one. Is there a trade fragger? Oh, Marv wow. again. He's beautifully good. He's so beautiful in these positions where he's just holding these angles. And look and, at this, Dan. The Seekers immediately come up from Victor. They go in three different directions, so Envy knows this B site is mega weak. They're just going to roll through. But Marv falls with Victor, Dan. This is now a winnable round for X10. Sushi Boy's in a good position for 1v1, but the swing from Crash is, is just stellar. And there's not much left now for Cruz. One versus three, and... Spike planted. That's the question. Now, what are we going to... What should we expect from both? God, I'm so afraid. 
for them right now, but Victor picks up the kill onto Scary around Tree. Oh damn, that's so big with the lockdowns going on in B right now. x has no idea where this hit's coming in, but they're all rotating A blindly right now. They're guessing and they're guessing right. Oh, the pop flash from Victor is so difficult for Sushi Boy. And now, what do they do on the retake here? Extend, do they just save what they have? They don't, I don't believe they have any money. And I, I really think they need to keep that operator alive. Spike planted. Yeah, they're carrying a lot right now. You'd really want to survive with all three. I don't think that Envy would have to lose two players in quick succession to create an argument to even go for this. Yeah, he's super interested in just chasing down these kills. They need to get out of here, Sean. Yeah, because Envy has enough money to hunt these right now, Dan. They don't mind losing a couple guns here. <gasps> oh, oh, no. no. Oh, no. They just needed to leave. And they wanted to get the frags here, Sean, but it seems to have backfired for them. They can't rebuy, I think, the operator for sure. They can't buy, rebuy that, I don't think. We're about to find out. I believe Craft is as well with the march. We know how good he is. Scary's on the on, on here as well. So they've actually got players into position. Patty able to get out, but eventually we finished off by Victor and Marv. What beautiful kills come through from them. Ten Cruz seconds. dropping down, maybe finding a timing. This player from, uh, from main as well. And got Foxy now also coming through from spawn. The question is, can Cruz hold until then? But he can't. He gets chased down by the remainder of Envy. And Foxy waiting out the recon. So, so difficult here. Three players to find. Oh, and oh, there is the, the info. info. <laughs> yeah, they know exactly where he is. He recons the wall. It'll get a couple pings. <gasps> nice Bit. opening from Foxy. But Victor's there to seal the deal. 7-5 finish for Envy on the first half. And Foxy is in mid. And we'll also have Victor there on the other side of the wall. See how that one plays out. But here comes the attack onto the A site. And that's trying to hold on towards Jen. He's creating quite a distraction, but the shots are suddenly favoring Cruz. Yeah, down to 20 HP. Can he stop? Oh, he's able to just get away from that one around Jen. Yay, trying to find the finish on him. Oh, yay! How much more can he get here? Not going to find it against Cruz. And that's going to be the round for X10. The pistol they needed. They're going to finish hiding wine. He's so early. Sitting in wine. Oh, with a stinger. Oh no! I can't find what he's looking for, but Marv is certainly... Oh, oh, he's actually unable to hit the shots he needs to, but they're just going to commit forward anyway, trying to bulldoze this one, and Victor, with that flash, is going to really ruin their chances, and they get out of there, still, with four players alive. And Marv has them contained, Dan. Marv's behind them. Oh, oh they just try to bulldoze matter. it. They just, they just keep going. Flowing. <laughs> yeah, this, these are those two frags that open up the round. And then Victor again, just send deep by Cruz. Marv and FNS are on this site. Ash for Killjoy, no utility. That's a good trade on to Marv though as they try to barrel into that A site. Okay, Cruz up, 40 seconds on the clock, so... Found them. Well, there's, at least, at least two players suppressed there with that one. That null command, Spike. the null point. We're going to see that they'll go straight forward again. Finesse has been great. 30 seconds left. Holding things down. And it's so labored here now. So many players here for Envy. They are just so good on this rotation. Sushi boys. Too much to do here as Envy again. They slow things down and they come forward. Oh my god. So much pressure coming forward here from Envy and <laughs> Oh, I love how he, he I love how he used the updraft there, but we'll go back to that in a moment. X10. Feeling the pressure, trying to push forward, trying to break these positions from Envy to make oh. their way to A and Crash is running around holding Mouse 1. Apparently that's that's cool. And the punish Whoa. from Fidesz onto Patty is just going to continue. Gets worse. Takes down the door. Unrelenting. The in-game leader, Fidesz, is going to just crush the round. He's on a heater. He's on a heater. 12-7, but they have a lot more to do. And Envy hasn't really had to break a sweat so far. So unfortunately for x if you look at the ults, the Hunter's Fury, the Cosmic Divide, the Seekers, those are round winning ults, Dan. Those are ra those are ults that, you know, on their own can win you rounds. They can win you retakes. They can win you really close mid rounds. So these rounds coming up, X Hunter just need to blow Envy out of the water. And Jay looking to hold the line in. Great shot. Gets out of there for free. Well, it's a dash, but. That's a 3k, just coming up straight away in favor of Envy. Yates goes out there, so fine. Cruz, what a response coming through for X10. Zeke is coming through. The flick to this one. Oh, the timing is there, but Cruz still goes down. During crashes are already here at tree. 
Just ready for the cross, and he's got to shoot the door afterwards. That's not going to happen. Crashies takes him down. X10 will go 